Een drie banken slaan nou. Ja. Dat is een geel sterren. Best bij weer. Ja, Ja, Guys, look at this absolute <laughs> beast of a fish. I have no words. So I'm just sitting here editing the second part of the yellowtail video for you guys as we fished um, throughout the night. But somehow we stuffed up a lot of the footage um, between all the chaos. So what I'm going to try and do is I'm going to like narrate the thing for you guys and then put something together because I really want to show you guys what happened the rest of the night. Um, AJ got two really nice ragged tooth sharks and um, you know, he got beaten up once or twice but a lot of the footage we messed up by um, yes the, the, the GoPro battery died, the torch died and um, I had a GoPro in the wrong mode, we had a burst scene and I thought we were recording and uh, my lighty in between hooked into a raggy and he lost it and it, it was just chaos. Most of those footage are lost or it's totally unusable. So it's a bit of a bit of a um, pity but I'm gonna try and put something together for you guys because it is locked down and it won't be soon before I can go out and make another video for you guys. So I need to show you some fish. So let's see if we can make the most of it. All right, here we go, part two. Oh shit, you're doing it at 3%, what's that wind like? Mm -hmm. I just threw a raggy bait out and um, first try is on with the bag. After catching that yellow tail, um, I was quite indecisive if I should throw for either a cob or for a, a raggy tooth shark. So while I was deciding this, AJ decided to throw a, a big bait for a raggy tooth shark and it wasn't long before it was on. So. After a short fight, AJ had this plus one 70 kilo raggy in the shore break, ready for me to grab. The young raggy! A young fish! Skin. The skin. Seven times. Yeah, we really battled. My GoPro was going flat. AJ's light was going flat. And my torch, as you can see, is flickering. It's also flat. And uh, we were quite some distance away from our tackle boxes. And we want to get the fish back, so there's no time to replace batteries on either the light or the. Um, GoPro, so we just had to work with what we had. Yeah. Oh, okay. Okay, sit for it. Let's see. 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 Of, of AJ's a cop. But the small little male raggy, about 70 kilos. Um, first throw for a bag. What a way to start the evening of the chaos with the yellow tails. Well, I missed out, but yeah. Any time before getting locked up for 21 days, eh? Yeah, <laughs> lekker. Yeah, but you are after him, after him, after him. What about the rain? 
Ja, ga lekker kijken, toch? Ga lekker kijken, extra. Uh, sorry guys, the battery is all flat on the torches. Going to replace them now. After I just put this fish back. What a lekker night it's been so far. Always lekker to fish, bro. I love it. Yeah. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> so, I get the so yeah guys, AJ just landed a like a 70 kilo bag and uh, I'm sure there's gonna be one or two more but I'm on the hunt for a big cop. So it's an hour before the low time. I'm gonna find myself an octopus and then I'm um, gonna throw for for a big a big big seriously big cop. So that will be awesome if you can manage to catch a yellowtail and a big cop in the same day. That will be absolutely fantastic. We've got really nice conditions. And um, yeah, I'm just gonna decide. I'm first gonna throw for a black ray and then for a cob, or first for a cob and then for a black ray. But I think first for a black ray on the low tide and as, as the tide starts to push, we're gonna throw for, for that cob. Man, I'm excited for this night. Yeah. I think it's gonna be lacquer. So let's hope. We can get some quality fish before we have to go and sit indoors. So yeah, yes, I'm excited. Lekker, let's go and find out Oki. crabs are way too relaxed when there's an octopus in the water the crabs scatter all over the world they're out of the pools and that's usually when the crabs are out of the pools that's a good indication that there's a octopus in the area because the octopus chows them flat out but um, these crabs are way too relaxed This place is just teeming with life. Little fish. There's little fish. Crabs and shrimps. It's so amazing to walk in the rock pools at night. It's absolutely stunning. It's like everything comes to life. There's a little cracker right there. Little muscle cracker. Okay, let's go. Thank you. Hello, Mr. Oki. There we go, perfect size for a cob bait. And just this light. Okay. Okay. Got him. Perfect size for a whole bait. Yeah. Okay, you can see. I put on a big bunny or sort of sort of head. And um, while I was looking for an Oki, AJ made another throw for a Raggy. And as I got to him... Three <laughs> minutes in the water. <laughs> three minutes in the water. <laughs> and he's on. Proper fish. Much bigger than that previous, about 70 kilo guppy, eh? <laughs> Maybe one seen. <laughs> oh. Angry. Woo! Yeah, it's off a mile, I think it's. But guys, this time of the year, the raggies are crazy. They, they're very aggressive. A lot of shakes. Yeah. A lot of shakes though, very aggressive, so look at that. Yes! <laughs> like, uh, <laughs> 
So I live get us. Good luck. That was proper bag this. Uh, I'm actually after a black eye. That's why I'm throwing a bonnie head. And then after a black eye, I'll make a, or the throw for the back of a black eye. I want a catch one as well. Fun to play. Black. Yeah, and after I made a throw for a black eye, I'm going to throw for a cock. Is Andre? Is Andre what's going on here, Buddha? We are not even talking about it. Right after this, things got a bit chaotic. Um, AJ moved a bit to the right to, to fight his fish on the right hand side. And then Zandra had a raggy pool and he was battling the raggy. So I couldn't film AJ with his fish, so he had to land his raggy all on his own. And then I completely messed up with the um, GoPro. Um, when I was recording, I thought I was recording. When I wasn't recording, um, I was actually recording. As you can see here, yeah, it's absolutely useless footage. And then um, when we had the raggy all uh, under control, we thought we were recording. We actually took burst shots, like I'll show you guys now. And um, we actually didn't have any of the recording or the footage what happened at that stage. So now we properly stuffed up. We thought we were recording and we actually just took a burst shot. So here yeah, we were explaining to you guys that AJ just had to land this 150 to 140 kilo raggy on his own without my assistance because I had to help Zandre with his raggy. But unfortunately, he lost it after a while. So yeah, look it up, AJ. See if you can help us. I was a bit mayhem for a couple of minutes but um, now it's luckily time for me to get a bait in the water there's a big sort of sort of head you can see hopefully this is gonna get a bait hopefully this is gonna get a bite I'm sure it's gonna go tighter right now yeah because while AJ was on with that raggy I was on his way to help him and um, Zandre went tight and unfortunately he lost it but um, yeah, sometimes he forgets that he's only seven years old and um, we're fishing for 100 kilo plus sharks and he wants to catch them. But shame, man. Let him learn the hard way. Trying that bonnie head now. Finally, after all that chaos, I eventually had a bait in the water and it was my turn to get a bite. It wasn't long and I got a pick up of a raggy, but unfortunately it just dropped me and left me. And I didn't come back at all. Yeah, 
Ja. Maar jou net. Dus er eigenlijk je didn't come back as we usually do. So I was uncertain if I still had bike left. So I had to warn you. During this time, I joked up again. Uh -uh. Oh, that bloody raggy. See, see, there is the cheese teeth marks. There is some bite marks. Bloody thing. Just picked me up, bounced me a couple of times, and then um, left my bite. So there's definitely some action today. And, um, there's a bit of grass that's starting to irritate us a bit, so let's hope it doesn't get worse. But yeah, lekker. I went back as quick as possible, put a new bike on, waited in, made a new track, and as I got back to AJ, we went flat this time with the bronze. Bronze Whaler, I think. <laughs> of course. Let the world. Very clever. Huh? Sister. Of course. She got a funny surprise. Well, AJ is through, and then probably two minutes after him, I threw, and when I got to him, he was on, like immediately. We're on, what we did is there's a bit of grass in the water, so we climbed up onto this rock, as you guys can see, to get away from the grass, and um, <laughs> yeah, it's not even necessary to get away from the grass, because are you on before the grass can be in your way? Yeah, look at the bronze here. What did I get covered by? I get the fall out of the tree. Yeah. What did I get covered by? The mask and the mirror that we know it's clear. really a good fish and I could see AJ put a lot of pressure on that fish but un unfortunately after a while the hook just pulled. We, we suspect that this is a really big bronze whaler but unfortunately it was one of those bad luck things where the hook just pulls it out and you have no reason to explain why it happened but the fish was lost. Oh, that's tough luck. We suspect it was a decent sized bronzy. And um, now it's off. I don't know what happened. What happened there, AJ? Lead it off or? I don't know. It feels like a hook pulled or hook opened or something like that. Probably hook opened. Oh. No, we suspect it was a big bronzy. It's just out of the hook. Um, yeah, very unfortunate. I would have liked to land this fish. Oh, Singer gone as well. Ha! Oh, well. There's Andre. Mm. Man down. Why is he no vacker, Ricky? Hi, what the? Yo. It's getting cold now. Guys, it's getting really chilly now, and uh, we decided to call it a night. A bit of grass in the water, not too much of school can fish, but it's getting late. Zandra is tired, he's man down there on the beach, and uh, yeah, it's been a really fun night. 
Asia Lanyard has two two raggies. He lost a big bronzy. I had a raggy pulled, got a decent yellow tail. Well, it's been a perfect night actually. It's it's lacquer, guys. So thanks for watching. If you like this video, give it a thumbs up. Please subscribe.